Hey guys and welcome back. Be sure to check out all of our picks for today's action over at stumpthespread.com which is linked down in the video description. Heading into this one, going to be talking about this Eastern Conference battle between the Miami Heat and the Brooklyn Nets. Give our take on who we feel has the better edge against the spread. Brooklyn coming into this one and it does look like point guard D'Angelo Russell will be able to go. It'll be interesting to see how him coming back into the lineup kind of affects things here for the Nets today at home against a Miami team that's been playing some really good ball as of late. So the Heat coming to this one as very slight favorites, sitting at about three-point favorites here. And on the year, the Heat, they currently stand at 26-18 and 18 overall. In this group, they have been road warriors. They always bring it on the road. They're 14-9 and nine away from their home court this year. Very impressive in comparison to the Nets, who are 16-29 and 29 overall and just 9-5 and five at home. In their last outing, the Miami Heat took care of business on the road against the Milwaukee Bucks, picking up that win by a final of 106-101. to 101. That was a great result for Miami, who had just beaten the Bucks not all that long ago, uh, and I thought the Bucks might have been in a revenge game situation at home, but still at the end of the day, the Heat were able to pick up another really good win against Milwaukee, and Miami, they've been playing just some tremendous ball over the last few weeks of action. They've gone on to an eight of their last nine games, and they've been showing that they can get the job done on the road. They've picked up recent road wins against teams like the Indiana Pacers, the Toronto Raptors, and of course, that win in their last outing against Milwaukee. But this is still a Miami team that has a negative point differential on the year, which is very surprising for a squad that's eight games above 500. But this number, it continues to shrink as Miami continues to pick up these wins on a consistent basis. They're 27th in the NBA in scoring compared to fifth in total team defense. And Miami, they've been bringing that consistent defensive effort throughout the entire regular season, but their offense has certainly taken a step in the right direction during this winning trend that the Heat have been on more recently. The home team today, the Brooklyn Nets, 13 games below 500, maybe a little bit more competitive this year than we've seen out of Brooklyn in recent years, but still nonetheless a team that's having a tough time. They're 13th in the NBA in scoring, 26th in total team defense, and they have a negative plus minus of about minus three points. The Nets in their last outing, they came up just short at home against the San Antonio Spurs, losing that one by a final of 95 to 100 in their game prior to that. Came at home against the New York Knicks and Brooklyn. They just didn't play much defense at all in that particular matchup, losing to the Knicks by a final of 104 to 119. And Brooklyn, they've just been trending in a very negative direction. They've lost uh, six out of their last seven games with their only win during the stretch coming against the Atlanta Hawks, who are another one of the lower tier teams in the Eastern Conference. So this one seems like a pretty straightforward one today. The Nets, they haven't been playing great ball in comparison to the Heat, who have been one of the hottest teams in the Eastern Conference over the last few weeks of action. And also Miami, they have just been a great road team this year, especially during this winning trend that Miami has been displaying. So with that being the case, we're going to go ahead, side with the Heat, giving the three points as our play. If you guys agree, give the video a thumbs up. If you disagree, give it a thumbs down. Check out all of our picks over at stumpthespread.com, linked down in the video description. And be sure to click that subscribe button on our YouTube channel. Thanks for stopping on in, and we hope to see you guys in future videos. Bye.